僕は残るわけにはいかないんだ。Welcome to Smashed Out number 87, 86. We got Reg Eggs versus Shitter. I know one of these two players, so we'll see how it goes. Not a hand warmer word. Falco North, fun matchup for 10% of the Falco players out there. Hmm. That up tilt was like super late on the fair. So you should have just went for a grab and recognize that it wouldn't work. Hey, he just gave up ledge. But he could have just down tilted, covered other options after that too. Oh, 
Oh, a classic side B through them into them missing the punish into you missing a punish on them. It's a classic. Power shield, power shield grab, actually kind of sick. Kind of just moving around aimlessly a little bit, but Regix finally hits him, gets a combo off of it. Cell cancel, I didn't really notice. I'm bringing up the chat currently. Hey, I'm here. Hello. Yep, grab ledge, but he just gave up the ledge because he probably wasn't uh, refreshing well enough. He noticed, or maybe he just gave up ledge. Nice down smash. Regix could uh, technically arms attack, but it's not it's not that easy. Rizix kind of dash dancing to bait things out, I would think, but he didn't punish any of the things he baited out, so next time he'll probably be aware of that. Uh, Shit will do something out of the corner when he's pressured. Oh no, missed time to down tilt. That sucks. Oh, he should have just grabbed ledge. That was a dead mark. The note tech, which is just instant death past 60, and not coming back from that. Oh no, he should he should kind of just either grab ledge or go out there. He kind of did a bunch of options that didn't cover all too much on stage. Up throw up air, kind of. It's okay, but you have to recognize if they DI the up throw or not. Because if they DI the up throw, you're just going to full hop into the sky and do nothing. And then be in a bad spot. Oh, he got a dash attack? I don't know if it probably didn't shift poke, but... Okay, Shitter abusing top platform versus Mark, which... There is there is some kind of... Oh, these double issues are getting super scary. Yo, what up, Taylor? How you doing? Yeah, he kind of just waited for him to tech and then cover the tech option. Oh, that was... Oh, my God. Don't say that, Tien. I'm not... That's just not true. Hey, well, you know, shield poke F smash. I guess that's cool for the Marth players. Am I... Am I playing? Oh, okay. Hey, well, I'll be playing after this set. I don't know who, though. But it's currently 1-0 Regex. He got a lucky, basically lucky F smash on shield that shield poked against Falco. Second worst shield in the game. A Ganon counter pick? I'm assuming Yoshi's. What the heck? Notoriously hard matchup for Marth. He kind of has to use his superior range and not get hit. Just play safe. And if you play safe, there's nothing Ganon can do. But we'll see how safe Regis plays play this matchup. Oh, 
Oh. Also, this this is like actually a gimmick. <laughs> this is not my. This is not a. It's not a counter pick I ever truly believe in. Where if your main doesn't do it, your secondary Ganon non Yoshi's will do it. But who knows? Maybe his Ganon's legendary. Oh, Calvar? Calvar? Tech chasing? Hey, but... mm. Wow, that grab was a little, a little nuts. Yo, you better come to defend the north. Because I will probably be there. And then you can watch me play Tekken and Unist instead of Melee. Or maybe Melee, who knows. Oh no! <laughs> He didn't walk forward with the F-Tilt. Maybe one for a dash attack, who knows? Don't call me a weeb, Tien. Eunice is the least anime fighter possible of the anime fighters. Another shield poke F-Smash, but that was probably planned because... Oh, Yoshi's platform is a little wonky like that. Okay, that might be a... Oh my god. <laughs> Just a dead mark. DBZ Fighters is literally about an anime. Hey, they're kind of just spacing around each other's aerials. Regex with the, the Calv Calvar. Okay, he, he keeps getting one regrab into no more regrabs. You do watch, you spend all your time in the anime club, T, and you can't say you don't watch anime. Hey, F smash is kind of over for the Ganon, unless something wacky happens. There, I would have just stayed on stage, but it doesn't matter. Uh, if Jake and Kevin and no one else from LI come, are you talking about for Defend the North? And who would I be teaming with? I'm down to team with any of the three people, but I'm just wondering. Oh, I wonder if that down smash was on purpose. Probably not. Cause I don't even know if it would it, it would not have killed. Him, so probably supposed to be down tilt. Me? Why wouldn't you be teaming with Kevin if Kevin came? Did you mean Chris? <laughs> oh my God! He killed off the top. Yeah, but definitely team. Yeah. Heck yes. Hey, I'm gonna go play my stream, or not my stream set, but my, my first set, and then I'll be back for commentary after I'm done. Also, if Jake and Kevin and no one else come from Long Island want to do teams. If Jake and Kevin and no one else. That's four people. One of those four people is Kevin, your static teammate. And the other one is Jake, not your static teammate. So I'm a little confused. Just comment. Com
conversation from before uh hey taylor can you please explain what you meant before i still don't know also puff falcon this matchup's an l for falcon well puff oh well, i guess it's not as much as an l because wizard won but at it i i believe between these two players it might be an l for falcon because Puff can just crouch. And depending if he knows whether or not he should be grabbing, he will lose. He does not seem to be grabbing though, so it's all good for now. Oh no! Mm -hmm. Uh, oh yeah. I mean, I didn't think about that. You should not have counterpicked Dreamland. That's a very interesting counterpick. I would have counterpicked a flat stage that didn't have giant blast zones or a top platform, unless you're going to abuse the top platform. But even then, kind of detect it. You didn't do it. Yeah, I would have went Battlefield, <laughs> but whatever. Let's. What the heck is ETF? What? Oh, it's his old tag. Oh, I guess it makes sense. Oh, he could have rested the first up air, but the up tilt worked. He didn't DI it, and he's dead. This is now Big Buffalo versus Toucan. Apparently, a smashed out classic. I've seen many GIFs on Reddit and Smash Twitter of Big Buffalo doing things to ICs that most people can't do. So we'll see how this goes. Oh, whoa. Did, did Doc Lob leave? Because I'm a little tight if he did. No, he didn't. Come back.
Dr. Lobster, I'm calling you to explain what you were saying before. Okay, Yoshi's banned that so probably two can head first ban. Big Buffalo Dome, Fox. He's thinking he calls himself a Fox Pub dual main. One of the weirder uh weirder dual mains I can think of. Hey, this will be fun. So, I'm assuming what Big Buffalo is going to do is stay on the platforms, drop down with Shine, and kill Nana. Because that makes this matchup a heck of free. All he has to do is actually go for Nana. Which a lot of people seem to not do, which kind of tilts me. Wow! Oh no, that, that was a little silly. I don't... Whatever. Big Buffalo got very lucky. Did you? Uh, I didn't hear it, but there was something. There was something there. How do I freaking turn chat only on my? Oh, there it is. Let's go. I don't want my phone to die. Now you got a wobble. He's back to even. But he was probably a little tilted that uh, Nana killed herself, and also that barely killed. What the heck? Oh my God, Nana taunted. They didn't even come from the spawn platform. Oh, Big Buffalo going for the Nana. I approve. Oh my lord. That's a almost dead Nana. Oh, that's... Wow. He actually covered the Nana there. I would have probably died from the down smash. No back throw ice block. Just back throw. Oh no. Back throw. Oh. That bird was good. It's just not high enough for Semper to really do anything. Another dead. Another Nana kill. Super early. If you're just sitting there killing Nana, I don't know. Oh my lord. Popo lived only because of the fire, but that was almost a sick, uh, a sick game. Big Buff kind of just doing Fox or Isis things. He's really just separating them super well. He's just killing now whenever he has a chance. Uh, probably gonna go. Uh, probably gonna go Pokemon. I don't know. This is still good for Fox. Just as that smash came out. I wonder if you call it a jumper for shield poke. There's probably probably a jump catch.
hopefully Toucan doesn't go into the, the pit. Because you can only lose stuff from going into the pit right now. Oh, that tech was actually dirty. Holy moly. Oh, okay. If he killed Nana off of that tech, that would have been disgusting. It's actually super hard to kill Nana on this on this transformation just because the shine won't push her off. Well, not super hard, but harder than normal. Now you kind of got stage hecked. Toucan's been re trying to, like, he's been doing back throw into Wave Dash into the stage a bunch of times. So I wonder if when he's going to realize that Big Buff is not rolling in there. Uh, yeah, there's no way. We shark them, so it's whatever. Two so can't pump himself up. That was that was that was a shield grab and a half. I would have shield grab there every day of the week. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought he'd side beat off the stage. That's lucky. Wait, Big Buff was actually just killing Nana so early each stock, and I don't even know what what I'm supposed to do because once it gets separated, it's over. Oh. A down tilt. I think only hit because of the, the weird stage look. Mm. Wow. That was insanely spaced. And he's just not respecting the ledge dash there. But unfortunately missed the punish on the side B. I'm very... I don't know what just happened. It looks like he smacked his knee. But nothing in game happened. Nice. That's death. Hey, this is winner's stock. You can. Up was a very odd angle. Could have just went down. Maybe he was expecting Two Can to do something active there. Oh, that up he was sick. But then the, the shine gave my nana was even sicker. Big Buffalo wins throw though. He's like pretty good at that matchup. He just kills Nana so often. Oh, I'm on stream. Word. <sighs> Time to play on stream.
Fox Yoshi? Whoa! Is he actually playing Falco? Why is he playing Falco?
Is he actually gonna go Falco though? So I wonder how Koopa Kevin normally does with Fox then. Because Falco is. kinda like destroys Yoshi, but so does Fox. I don't know. Let's we'll see. Ooh, the Yoshi N score music is so sick. Wow, he is going Falco. Uh, JLo has experience in this matchup, but this matchup is about A2, so I don't know how much it's gonna help. But he has like pretty good power shields, and his shield drop game is good, so. Depends whether or not Koopa Kev can catch on to that type of stuff. Oh, he misses parry. That sucks. I mean, not parry. He misses double jump. He didn't air too early. But yeah, Falco kind of destroys Yoshi. It's unfortunate. Shield drop. What the heck? Nice DI. On the down air to not just straight up get murdered. Oh, he just gets knocked off back off stage. Wow. Cool kid went out there and because that just missed. Now up till Phantom into still recognize <laughs> recognize that a Phantom jab reset is pretty dope. Yeah, shield drops. Egg loses to everything, so I don't know how much I agree with egging a Falco coming out of the air, but whatever. It still led to a kill. Oh, that was sick. I love up air. Up air combo starters and stuff for Falco are so sick. Oh, JLo egg game. Let's see if he can still do it. He's an adult now, so. That was a cool jab reset, but fortunately didn't lead to anything. Okay, well, I mean, he's super dead. Oh! Koop kept getting grab blade. That sucks. That should be death. What? How did up tilt kill but not up? How did up air kill but not up tilt? That's silly. Good guy of attack. Maybe he just timed it for when the jump happened, so he's basically invincible against all of his options. Oh, he covered, wow, that covered every option, I think. He used the egg to cover roll uh, attack to the right. Mm. That was a little, that was not the best double laser because Jayla was just on top of the platforms, but he didn't get punished for it, so it's whatever. Oh, he was going for some cheese. Going for some neutral beat cheese. Oh no. I don't think shield grabbing works with Yoshi. <laughs> I mean, I respect it, but. I think the odds of it happening are almost zero. Your opponent has to not mash at all to die to stuff like that. Oh, he's probably gonna go ever. I actually have, oh, Yoshi's what? That's a little, a little wacky. I would not have gone here. Wow. 
I wonder, he probably shouldn't have egged, because I think it looked like he could still combo off of it, but... I don't know, the egg kind of just ended the combo early. It has too much egg life to do anything. Hey, well, this counter pick's working out for him so far. Despite... <laughs> Yeah, that's dead. Whoa! He could have done something, but that's impossible to react to. Nah, there's no way. I think if he did downer to the top platform and did like up tilt shine, that might have worked, but he's way too low for that to work from where he was. These up smashes are really interesting, like to cover the shield drop. I wonder why he's doing them, like compared to like, you know, maybe dash away grab or up tilt or something like that. Oh, the snipe! Yeah, sure. Alright, All right, what's up everyone? Toucan here. It's like, uh, we're in the final few seconds of this match, or whatever. Um... How's JLO been playing? He's been doing fine. Uh, he's kind of just been messing up a little bit here and there. But I'm a, I'm just a little surprised to see Koopa kept playing Falco. I didn't know he played Falco. Ever. I didn't know either. So, so this is a surprise for me as well. The thing is, Falco destroys Yoshi. So oh no. Yeah, he got lasered out of his double jump. I don't think Yoshi's armor can go through the lasers. Uh, I mean it, it can go through. It's just he didn't. I don't think he had. A, I don't think he had his double jump still. situation. But uh, he could have recognized that Randall was there by the time. It's whatever. I don't think it will hurt him too much, but... Oh, oh no, that yeah. should be it. That's not, uh, no, not quite. No. Oh, no. The oh. the, the Nair just missed. Yeah. Oh, boy. And Jello's in a bad position. Oh, oh Randall, Randall kind of messed him up there. That won't do it. I think he'll make it back. He, oh, oh, no. Oh, he air dodged. That sucks. Hey, yeah, Kubikip. that does kind of suck. Kubikip came out on top 2-0. Don't say me. Yeah. Shouts for Koopa Cub with the with the surprise Falco though. I actually well from the little I saw that was a good idea to go that in the Yoshi matchup. Yeah, it's it like Fox Yoshi Fox still destroys Yoshi, but Falco it's it's not even close. Yeah, that might be his worst matchup. <laughs> like, I that or Peach. Maybe. Yeah, I've heard pe bad things about Peach. I haven't really seen it, but um. Oh, I gotta play again? Okay. Oh, All right. oh, nice bomb. commentating with you. <laughs> yes, nice commentating <laughs> for the whole one minute. <laughs> See you guys later. Hey, next is Scrub and Concuss. Falco versus Buff, I think. Probably my second favorite matchup to play is Falco. He's being forced to use the comfy chair. I don't approve, but whatever. <laughs> I'm excited to see how this how this goes down because not a lot of Falcos know this matchup. And if you don't know the matchup, it, it can be rough, but who knows? I'm on stream next? Cool.
they're just setting up, I guess. Puff player taking forever to put in this controller. Uh, they're probably gonna go Battlefield or, oh no, nah, probably FOD or Battlefield. Wow, he struck FOD. Hey, well, they were doing something and then backed out from that, so. What? I'm confused. I think there was a complication with pause and one of them got confused a little bit. Okay, well, oh, hey, first off, teching pound, crucial. I'm really happy he tech pounds, because if he didn't, he would just get rested eight trillion times. Also, that tech on the up air was great. And it seems like Scrub kind of knows what he's doing, so. That was kind of, that was, that was a great combo. Scrub is tossing out these dares. Concuss has to kind of just oh, and he just tech Jason. Concuss has to like space his back or base almost perfectly to be there. So if he's not doing that, he's not gonna have a great time in neutral compared to how he normally would with just lasers. Coming back, coming down back is kind of scary because yeah, I would. I mean, it was a good trade for Scrub. I don't think I don't think he did it on purpose, and neither can cost, but whatever. Scrub is playing pretty risky at the ledge, but I mean, it hasn't cost him yet, so it's whatever. It seemed like he was trying to crouch cancel and shielded before he got hit, which I don't know why he would do that, but this is this is kind of kinda of looking gross. Oh he should have just grabbed ledge. Hey whatever. It ended up getting kill anyway, but he's making that way too complicated. More complicated than it had to be. Should've just grabbed ledge. His backers are just like slightly too far, but not far enough to where they can't be punished. So he's doing a back air close enough to Scrub to where Scrub can just hit him for it, which is the opposite of what you want to happen. Mm. He could have done like a... Frick. Hey, well, he brought it back, so... Let's see if he can do it. That was... Oh my god, Scrub, you freaking idiot. That was so stupid. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> see, it finally cost him last stock. He just went for something silly off stage on like a read. When you didn't have to, you could have just let him come back and play neutral again because you've been winning neutral. But he just went off stage and died. Uh... Still best of three, so probably gonna go. Oh, ugh. what the frick! <laughs> I would assume this. I would expect this to be banned, but I guess not. Um, this is like by far the worst stage in the matchup. Maybe he knows something about Scrub. Oh, nice! That was sick. That was some really good. I mean, he just he just kind of read him. If he can get a rest right now, this will be very hard for Scrub to come back from. 
He just missed the wave land. It would have been death otherwise. Dude, what the f- What is he doing? Yeah, that's death. Yeah, this, this game's over. Oh no. Yeah, okay. I mean, it. if he gets like a Shine Gimp off the top, it might be doable, but... I don't know, he kind of just went off stage too many times. Oh no, Randall, yeah. Hey, well, he's fortunate to have lived. Both of them are, actually. Hey, yeah. That was pretty good from Concuss. Kind of just beat him fair and square. He's getting smack talked. I'm now up. Guys, two cams back on the mic. We got Big Buffalo and Baby Bird, game number one. And it looks like Baby Bird is spreading his wings right now. With a pretty good combo right there. Misses the dare to end the game. Good forward throw right there, though. Good runoff dare, though. And Baby Bird's going to take game number one. Yeah, this is a battle that you would not expect to 
baby bird versus a giant buffalo. So, and it's represented by a bird and a fox. Yeah, this game's weird. Anyway, we're taking, we're going to FD for game number two. Um, I think this would be good for Fox, although it is good for Falco in terms of um, having space to uh, stall with the lasers. Oh, good tech by Big Buffalo right there. Uh, that saved his life. Good quick side B to get back on the and get back to uh, center stage. I definitely think the lack of platforms hurts Falco more than it does Fox in this case, just because Falco lives by his pillar combos. I mean, he can still get them on this stage, but um, platforms definitely play a huge factor. Good spot dodge right there to avoid the roll. That's not going to be a stock, actually, but that back air will take it. And this is the best out of five because we are in winner semis right now. All right, good back air from Big Buffalo, gonna even it up. Baby Bird's fighting back with the laser pressure. Oh, good crouch cancel on the up smash right there. Oh, oh, that was a weird up tilt. That like sent him down. That side B's, well, he kills himself. I don't think he would have made it back even if he didn't shorten that because he was pretty low. Excuse me. Baby Bird switching up a little bit, waiting a little bit on that shield pressure. I like that idea, actually. It's something you don't see too, too often. That back here will take the, take the stock, though, and we got a dead even game. Oh, oh yeah, shot there with another dare. That dare, another great tech by Blake Buffalo, but he messes up the angle. And Baby Bird is up by one clean stock. And, Bub, and Baby Bird is putting on the shield pressure now. Good get up attack to avoid the up smash. And he shines before he can grab. Very nice. And uh, oh, the charge forward smash. Buffalo's on the rope. That's going to do it. Game number two going to Baby Bird again. All right. So let's see where Big Buffalo is going to go right now. Um, if I had. I would say Stadium, but I'm not sure. Oh, and we have the character switch to Jigglypuff. Buffalo was telling me earlier he used to main Jigglypuff, so let's see how this goes. Um, Buffalo was saying that he was thinking of making the switch to the Jigs. Um, I just really don't agree with it, but that rest is going to make me eat my words right there. Taking the first stock, though. Buffalo still has some stuff with his puff. I'm not sure if Baby Bird was um, expecting the switch right there. That Nair, not going to take it though. Dreamland being a very big stage. Down Smash will not take it again. <coughs> I'm get some gum in my mouth. The reflex is acting up. Good forward smash right there. That's going to even it up. Good DI on the up throw right there. That would have that avoided a rest. Big Buffalo going for the up tilt, but he gets sucked out by the shine. Oh, the crouch cancel rest. Very smart by Buffalo, knowing that you could crouch cancel that re uh, crouch cancel that dash attack at that percent. Uh, Buffalo's looking for the up tilt right there. There's the, he gets the up tilt, but unfortunately. Baby Bird does DI out of that. Very good DI on Baby Bird's part. He is open. Oh, the get up attack is going to save him. Up smash. Baby Bird starting to fall behind right now. Don't agree with those lasers because a lot of them missed. Good up tilt though. That's going to take the stock. But Baby Bird is pretty far behind. 99% to be exact. That back here knocks him off stage, but he gets back. Does not go for the double dip there. Good shielding the up smash, but that is safe on shield apparently, so the grab's gonna miss. Here come the pillar combos. Nice forward smash, and he basically evens up the percentage right there with that one combo. Unfortunately, that pound is gonna take the stock. I think he was hit out of his double jump, 
Beaver smiling. I think I was right with that. But that dare is going to even it up, and B and Big Buffalo is on his winner side stock. Oh, miss a potential rest situation, but it was avoided. Good waiting out the pound by Baby Bird right there. All right, we've seen he's playing a little bit more patient with these lasers. Here comes the grab, the pound. Okay, good back air. Puff at kill percent. Well, she's been at kill percent for quite a while now. Good back air. Not going to take it, though. He gets the weak hit. The big Buffalo's got to figure out something in order to get back to stage. But that back air is going to take it. Baby Bird 3-0 over Big Buffalo, knocking him in the loser's bracket. Even though the Puff pick did throw him off a little bit, I think Baby Bird did a great job adapting there. Buffalo showing that he does have more um, characters up his sleeve, though. So good shit to him. And that also means I'm eventually, hopefully, crossing my fingers, gonna get my rematch with Buffalo. And I'll turn him into Buffalo Wild Wings. Yup. Okay, but enough trash talk. What's up? Oh yeah, okay. Speaking of which, we got Big Buffalo join us right now. Um, we got Koopa Kev and Concuss coming up right now. I guess he wants to um, commentate with his friend. It's pretty good. Sorry about the salt earlier, by the way. Yeah. Yeah, I try and make, if I'm salty, I try to make sure I cool down and stuff. I, I try not to show up on the scene. Yeah, I get like that too once in a while. Yeah, it happens. I hate, I hate Falco so much. <laughs> oh, really? You could tell, like, I'm just like, I don't know, I just get comboed and I can't do anything. You feel that? That's why I switched to Puff. Yeah, I, I feel that too. Like, I, I, trust me, I've been there with Falco, like, especially against Lint. Lint, yeah. like, once Lint gets in, he just, he just wrecks you. I know he does, and there's only one time I took a game off him. One time. <laughs> it was one time I took a set off of him. That was like about two years ago, yeah. back at uh, Scarsdale. Oh, you got a little better now, right? <laughs> oh yeah, I I know I can beat Lynch, but I haven't played him in, in months. But he hasn't he hasn't came that much. Really? Yeah, he hasn't came here. I mean. I oh mean. yeah, that's right. Like none of the Connecticut crew besides myself is um come here. Anyway, hopping into weird right. semis, we got Concuss versus Koopa Kev. Game one right. on battlefield. We got Concuss going as trigger signature pup, and Koopa Kev sticking with the Falco. Actually, mm. we saw this Falco a little bit earlier tonight. Well, we we discussed that Kevin didn't want to try hard today, so he's going with Falco. Interesting. I'm yeah. I'm wondering why. Maybe it was la um, how he did last week. We wanted to take a take it a little bit easier. But yeah. he showed his Falco is pretty uh, proficient. Oh, I thought he was going to actually SD right there with that uh, sing because I thought yeah. he reversed it. Tim, Tim, he's a puff that really tends to SD. He's a puff. He's shown SD, but he does. <laughs> <laughs> That's something that you don't really hear too often. All right. Well, um, you know what? He, he beats Scrub. He must be doing something good. Oh, uh, that is. And that up he's going to take it, though. Can cuss mm. down one stock. I, is he switching his song? Yeah, yeah he's switching his song mid-set. Okay. Uh, that's, he does that. Yeah, that's something I try not to do. And I, I, I've only done it like once or twice. Yeah. But I, I, I've had people do that to me before, and I'm like, oh, come on, man. Seriously. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't listen to music. I, I mean, maybe it'll help. I never tried it. It helps because, like, especially if you have a loud crowd, so someone shall, like, shouts, shouts like, oh, yeah. that, that sounds, I find that distracting. Yeah, I, I mean, I don't find it too, too distracting, but, like, last talk, it can be very distracting. Yeah. Plus, um, <laughs> when you're like me, I, listen, I love Melee's music, but I get tired of it. Oh, yeah. So, I, you, you play it for so long, you get tired of the yeah. freaking Dreamland music. Yeah. Although, I, I mean, Dreamland's a given, but, um. Yeah. But this song right now, this is actually one of my more favorites. Sometimes I will legit listen to this. Oh, like, I want to I I do that. I want to get that far. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty dedicated. Like someone said that I listened to the Dreamland song on uh, Dreamland one time. That wasn't true. I'm pretty sure it was Found in a Dreams. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. He was, oh, he wants to listen to the really? Oh, he changed it again. Okay. What, well, is he changing every stock? I don't know. Well, you're, I think you're playing the loser this, aren't you? I don't know. Like, I don't know how brackets work that well. So. Did you, did you, no, I, I saw. I, I looked at it. That's why. Okay, so. Did you? Did you play? You played higher fan, and who else? I played higher fan. Um. Oh God. Uh, Regex. Regex, yes. Okay, you do play. You do play loses this. Ah oh, boy. Listen. Uh. I don't know, maybe rather, I think you'd rather play Kevin, to be honest. That's right. He's going to get the run back because last time I, I got him pretty good. I think he has, I know he SD'd his the last time I played him, like yeah. that on his last stock. Well, I'm gonna, it's going to be interesting if he goes Falco against me. Yeah. I don't know. I, it looks like you're going to be playing Tim, though, <laughs> the way this is looking. 
Oh, oh yeah, that's right. It's winners. Shit. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Some kind. Of, this is that's ADD for you guys. So. <laughs> All right, good back air string right there. Yeah. We he, get back. He called himself the Falco Slayer. He's losing the one right now. <laughs> He's like in the car. I'm gonna beat all of you. I'm like, no, I don't think so. That's like when I was like, when, back in the day, I called myself a Mart Slayer, and then all of a sudden I started getting like doing worse against Mart. Like all the Marts suddenly got good, and I'm like, shit. No, it, it, it's like it's very egotistical. I don't, I can't. Like I call myself Icy Slayer as a joke, but I take I take every Icy seriously. You have to. Yeah, that, I mean that's why I do. I take everyone seriously. Yeah, I, listen, I, like, I have a big problem. I have a big problem with that. Like, we, like winners round one, I'm like, oh, this is free. Like, I can't say that because I have lost winners round one because I thought that. <laughs> and, yeah. Unfortunately, I fall into that stereotype too. Granted, I just, I still do my best, but um, yeah. yeah. Sometimes it's not as clean cut. Yeah. Kevin looks like he knows what he's doing. Yeah, well, they, definitely. We, we play all the time. Me, Kevin, Tim. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It looks like in cuts, it's not gonna work out this one. It is a best of five, so he has some time to come back. Is it really? Oh. Yeah. Uh, the back air won't take it right there, but the next one will. He needs to get off his head. That back air will take it because of the bad di, and Koopa Kev is up one all. There we go. <laughs> all right, so. I can see Concuss going to a much larger stage, like maybe FD. Because uh, less platforms equals less put combo potential for Falco and more rest opportunities for him. Uh, Dream, I mean, not Dreamland. Uh, Stadium can also work out a little bit well, though there's two platforms there. Uh, he goes I mean, to Dreamland. It's puff. He's going to Dreamland. <laughs> yeah, uh, I keep forgetting about Dreamland. Of course, yeah. Hungry Box just goes there all the time, so why yeah. the hell am I thinking? All right. Um, oh, we, got, we got 15 viewers, dude. Oh, hey, what's up, 15 viewers in the chat? Yeah. All right. Every, everyone thinks I'm Baby Bird. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not. Oh, we do. We do oh. sound the same. I actually agree. We sound like kind of the same. Yeah, I can see the similarities. Yeah, a little bit. And of course, I'm 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 the guy who just everyone mistakes for a girl on the phone. Like literally at work, whenever I call someone, like they're always like, "Okay, ma'am, how can I help you?" I'm oh, like, God. I'm a guy, by the way. Kind of embarrassed. <laughs> yeah, I'm f I'm freaking used to it you by know, now. You know what? I I I still have my voicemail from like when I was in fourth grade. It's like. It's like, hi, it's Carl. Leave a message, like, like that, like really girly. Yeah, like, cause I, I was like ten. I think my voicemail is still the same, like it was in high school or something like that. Like I haven't replaced it since. Oh yeah, Doctor Lobster, you're not crazy, dude. We do sound like. I told, yeah. I told, I told him today. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we got Car we had not Carl. We got uh, a yeah. concussed with the lead right now. Almost pretty much a full stock lead by this point, and this he's laughing percent. Now he's up by two. If stock. Tim goes in the winners' finals, that'd be insane. Honestly, he he, he needs a good run. He he doesn't ne he never has a good run. Yeah, yeah. The, I think this is the farthest I've seen him get right now. And he's um, doing pretty well against Koopa Kev right now, even though he's down a game. I, I, I really, I really think Kevin is, is more clutch than Tim. I don't know, just just by playing with him all the time. I would agree. Yeah. I mean, the results show. Yeah. I mean, don't get me wrong. Um, Tim has some pretty good. Um, he can be pretty clutch because Puff is that character that can get those clutch rests. Um, yeah, and, and, and he he's been he's been trying to play like more lame in those last tech situations. Yeah, that's his issue. There's a rest right there. Yeah. Um, that I think that has been Concuss's issue. Concuss's issue, just because like he just plays too aggressively. Honestly, like yeah. he needs to like keep. He needs to switch it to be playing lame a little bit. As, as stupid as that is. You know what? I, I used to main pub too, and I'm I'm still trying to since I saw. since you saw me going pub. I'm like I was getting like shined and stuff by Falcon. I'm like no, I'm, I'm trying to pub, <laughs> and like it, it went it was closer somehow. Yeah, yeah, I think you threw him off a little bit with the change of puff, but he adapted. You know, we played friendly too, so like he, he know, he kind of knows what I'm doing also. That could do it too. Yeah. It always sucks when you have to play that guy you played friendlies with. You're like, oh crap, he knows how I play now. Yeah, yeah I know. I, I mean, I know it's kind of grimy, but I like playing against people I don't. I never played against before because they don't know what I, they don't know what I do. Yeah. I, uh, you know. I'm just lucky if I get on a setup when I get there because I usually yeah. survive pretty late. Like, they, I got I got here today and they're like, it's 7:37. It starts seven minutes ago. I'm like, yeah. I'm like you guys are kidding me, right? Please, yeah. guys. Ugh. I preferred when this started at eight, to be honest, but yeah. that's all right. Well, I I I think uh, I might come and fit today because I'm probably gonna be playing JLo, my demon. Oh, your demon? JLo, I hate Yoshi. Like, I can't play against Yoshi. I mean, I can, but I'm not sure if I can today. Well, we'll see. Yeah. Um, anyway. Maybe, maybe go Puff, actually. <laughs> Use Puff Yoshi. Good. Oh, God. I don't know how that worked. Well, that's a very stalling matchup for Hungry Box versus Omsa is anything to believe. Uh, but anyway, getting back to this. Oh, uh, he's going back. Look at yeah, this. Yeah, Koopa Kev has brought this back. He's like, he's he's not afraid to play it. He's at 160. Yeah, that's it. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> 
Okay, okay. Concuss ties it up. Good showing by him. Yeah. All right, so now we're going to see uh, what Koopa Kev's going to go to. I'm thinking he's going to go Yoshi's. Yeah. Actually, Tim loves Yoshi's, but they're going to go there anyway. Yeah. And I was right. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Someone give me 10 bucks. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, so less space, more platforms equals more pillar combos for Falco. Less chances for Puff to stall but, out. But rest does kill at zero. It does. Guaranteed, yeah. pretty much. Yeah. So it is a little bit of a double-edged sword. Dude, I don't know how we have like 20 viewers for like like Tim vs. Kevin Winter Semi. <laughs> well, it is pretty hype when you see uh, someone that doesn't get this far normally. I mean, it's always hype seeing the underdog. That's why I love rooting for the underdog. Oh, yeah. That's why I love rooting for Icy's, because no one plays them. Eh, I mean, no, people still play them. I mean, I don't know. Like, the only time I'll root against an Icy's is if my team's going against them in a crew battle. That's literally it. Yeah. Or if maybe a friend I'm playing is doing it. Oh. Unfortunately, uh, Concussed SD there. I think he ran out of jumps. I think, yeah. he, I think he didn't realize that he had only one jump left. I was I was talking to Tim and Kevin before, and they're like, maybe you should try different characters during the set and throw people off. I'm like, I don't know. Yeah, the problem is is that you're not gonna play as good because it's not your main. Yeah, yeah. I was pl I was playing as Puff, and like, I, like I I would maybe I would have took that game if I was like more warmed up as Puff. You know, I was missing some stuff. I was like standing on the platform doing nothing. That's just from me not playing Puff in a long time. Yeah. In my opinion, so. All right. That back air. Oh, and he doesn't get Randall. Almost gets him, but he doesn't quite. All right, so Kankas has a little bit of work to do, but this is definitely doable. This is uh, one grab to potential up throw rest away from um, yeah. bringing it back. There's the up throw, but he gets the platform. I, I, I think this chat can help me with my Falco problem. What do I do against Falco? They'll, they'll tell me. <laughs> Down B. <laughs> it doesn't work. I tried. Uh, Everyone in the chat's like, hey, Kevin. <laughs> Alright, he doesn't punch the down smash right there, though. Um, the, the only, I play I play Falco and Stim's Puff for fun sometimes while we're, play, well, we're playing around at, our, at one of our houses. And, like, the only stage I can beat Tim on with Falco is Yoshi, so. <laughs> because I can just shine him off the top. I feel like I'm that way sometimes with some top little foxes and stuff, where it feels like the only time I can win is if it's on FD, and then I feel bad. And I'm like, if I since I won on my uh, best uh, stage, is that really uh, a win? Uh, FD, uh, FD's okay versus Icy's, I, I think. I think Dreamland's one of the worst stages against Icy's. That, that's why I don't know. Dreamland and FOD. Um, I mean, I feel like against you personally, yeah. the way you play, Dreamland might actually benefit you because you kind of just stall a little bit by just jumping well, around. Yeah, the, the re yeah, I, I do that because when, when, when my movement's like very chunky, I do that. When, when I'm confident in my movement, I'm going. That's yeah. That's the way it is. I wasn't, I, I haven't attended a local in like months, so. Yeah, that's all right. I, I've been, I was there. I mean, I beat you to the punch, but trust me, I haven't been to this in a, in a while. Like, I've been go starting to go religiously now on Mondays and Thursdays for Melee and Ultimate. And you guys should, too. Yeah. Come on out. You, oh, you play Ultimate? Yeah, I play Ultimate, and I play Ice Climbers. Oh, yeah. Never I played you online. <laughs> yeah, I can't believe I ran into you online. <laughs> I, I wasn't sure that was you, but I'm like, oh, he plays Ice Climbers. I yeah. think it's you. Yeah, and I saw his, like, Big Buffalo. Like and I'm like, wait. I was like, is that the Big Buffalo I know? And like, then I got the friend request, like, like yeah, five minutes later. I'm me. like, oh, yeah, it's like, that's him. <laughs> oh, my God. What are the chances? I mean, we, we are like both. We both live like near each other. Yeah. But, but, so but what are the chance that we press start at the same time and have around the same GSP? That's weird. Isn't that it? is pretty weird. Anyway, but, um, like, like I can't even snipe my friends online. I just sniped you randomly. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. Um. Anyway, um, we got um, Concuss going to FD for game number four. FD is very. FD is good for Puff. I don't. I don't like it. Per, FD is good against Puff. Good for Puff against Falco, not Fox. Yeah, I agree. But um, when Falco. I don't know. Certain Falcos like it. Certain Falcos hate it. I feel like Kevin likes it. Yeah. Oh, I think that was a misinput right there, Man. but um, it, it didn't hurt him too bad because I mean. I, th I think I think you could beat Tim, but I'm not sure if I could beat JLo. So. Yeah, like here's the thing. Uh, Tim usually he takes at least one game on me. Like last time we played, he took the first game off me, and then I started uh, coming back on him. Like I adapted. It's just that, oh God, I, I just don't like going up against certain Puff players. Like, Puff is one of those matches I just don't like. Yeah. It's, not, it's not my least favorite matchup, but at times it makes me want to pull my hair out. No one likes Puff. I don't like Puff. Yeah. Well, I, I, I didn't mean like that. No one likes, I like, I don't know, I like watching Puff and... Like I, I, I don't I, I don't like criticize them, like they play very good, but I just don't like playing against it. I, I just don't like playing Puff either. And the funny thing is, is that Puff is a slow defensive character and yet she doesn't get as much shit as Ices does. 
Yeah. And that just bothers me because ice creamers are fast. They do some really fast yeah. stuff. They keep the it's pace the of the game going, aside from the wobbles. Yeah. But Puff is slow. Yeah. And has a one-hit KO attack that KOs one in one hit like 90% of the time. Yeah, I yeah. realize why it just says an oxymoron, but still. The, the confidence him would rest that he's not confident. He always rests his rolling. Yeah. Yeah, so Kubakev doing a very good job uh, keeping the pressure on. And looks like Mikus is in a lot of trouble right now, sitting at 110%. Uh, second to last stop. Good grab, though, but his shield is very tiny. Uh, Here comes it, the recovery. You know what? I'm, I might just, oh, yeah, I think I might play Scrub, actually. Wait, oh, yeah, Kevin beat Scrub, right? Uh, yeah, he did. Uh, I didn't see. Let me, let me check the front. I haven't played Scrub in a hot minute. He's a little rusty like me. We're both uh, like we're both like trying to get back into it. Yeah, this is what happens when we don't have the the monthly and we're all busy with school. Yep, and yep, stuff. I play, yep, I play Scrub on stream. Yeah. Up, oh, good luck, man. I think I'm I think I'm actually gonna buff actually. I, I'm not trying to do a really? Fox Falco set. Interesting. He goes for the pound right there. I don't agree with that at all. I, I don't I don't mean to be mean, but if Tim beat Scrub. I think I can too. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I guess you could say he's a scrub. No, I'm, just, yeah. I'm sorry. I, in all seriousness, Scrub is a really good player. No, he is. He is. He, he just. I, I think I'm decent. I'm, I'm not saying I'm good at all. But I'm just, I, I think I'm decent around here. Yeah. I honestly, I don't think I've taken a set off of Scrub. I, I think I've taken games, but I'm not taking a set. Well, th this is your day if you play him. All right. I gotta get through Tim first, most likely. You gotta get through. Yeah, if you get through Tim, you might play Scrub or me, whoever. I don't know. Okay. Yeah. All right. So he's on the ropes. Um, right, he's spamming out the back airs, and it's too little, too late. Yeah. Kuba Kev takes it 3-1 over to Cost. It was too, it was too good to be true for Tim being winner his finals. Oh well, but he does get it pretty far. He's... Yeah, I did. I 2 owed him. Yeah. Damn, want Timmy win? No one wants Timmy to win. I don't. I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh man. All right. I think I'm probably gonna be playing next. Let's see who's coming up next. Oh, it's me. Oh no, we got bit. We got uh, our very own big bubble. We, we got think Icy's puff and Fox. Uh, you know what? If the puff game goes bad, I might just go Fox. I don't. I don't know. Yeah, go Fox. Like he's really good against Icy's. He knows how to play him. I, I'm gonna try. Actually, I'm gonna try puff first game, and then play Fox. I don't know. I gotta think about it. J just just by the way Scrub's playing, I th I think I should play puff. Uh, yeah, that's up to you. Like I haven't seen how he's been playing. Um. I just know that um, Scrub is a very patient Falco. I mean, he's not really like those aggressive Falcos like Lint. He prefers to like wait out what his opponent is that's doing. A, that's interesting. I, I, I struggle against both Falcos. I struggle against Campy Falcos, aggressive. You know, I know. All right. All let, right. Let me go play. All right. Wish good me luck. luck. Good luck, man. All go right. for it. All right. So, solo two can right here. Got so, a solo, but still two cans. All right, so like we said, Big Buffalo versus Scrub coming up right now, uh, loses quarters. All right. Big Buffalo saying he's going to go puff. Let's see what's going to happen. This is the first time I've seen Scrub in a while. According, according to um, the uh, standings for our um, Defendant North, uh, excuse me, According to the stats of our Defend the North um, free room event going on right now, Scrub is on the, the top 10 right now, and I haven't, I haven't seen him. I guess I've, either he's been coming and I've missed him. So that probably that's probably a thing. All right, anyway, we're going to hop into Battlefield, game number one. Good song coming up right now. We got Pup versus Falco. Yeah, it's Falco night, ladies and gentlemen. So let's see. Scrub known for being a pretty patient Falco. Oh, gets the rest right there. Good stuff to Big Buffalo. He takes the first stock. I think that was a read right there, so that was pretty risky. Up tilt, does not go for the rest. Wise move because that was a great DI on Scrub's part. That would have been very tricky to hit. All right, he is at kill percent right now. Good pound to get back on stage, though. Up. Oh. Stuffs out the up air, but the back air will take it, and we have a Ted even game in terms of stocks. Yeah, not much that Puff can do against uh, with back air stalling if uh, Falco's just laser camping. Good back air, though. Uh, shield. Misses the deer, though. That shield is getting pretty small. Another pound might break it, but I think he's recovered it by now. Good falling lasers right there. 
Oh, nice forge smash right there, and that's going to take it. So far, the uh, pump pick is good. We're going to help car Up the rest. He is going to survive with good DI, though, and here comes the punish. Good down smash. Not going to take it, though. That forward tilt is going to keep him off stage. Running out of jumps. Oh, but he gets the stage spike. Oh, but the uppy is going to take a double trade right there. And in uh, Big Buffalo's favor, though. That was a mess, I will admit it, ladies and gentlemen. But it worked out in Big Buffalo's favor. All right. Scrub is going to have to put on the aggression right now. He is a very patient Falco, but he can definitely play the aggressive game. Good Shorn right there, though. Misses the forward smash. That's a rest. That's going to do it. Game one going to, to, to Big Buffalo. And a solid two stock right there. So let's see where Scrub is going to go right now. I'm pretty sure he's going to go Yoshi's. Yep. All right. Game two. He's got more platforms and less room. Oh, up throw. Good read by Carl right there. But good, good DI. He's going to make it back. But oh, he barely punches. Oh, he doesn't go for the second shine, though, which is very interesting. I think that would have left him open, though. Up throw, rest. He is going to get punished, though, for this. Here comes the charge up smash. That's going to take the stock. I don't agree with Scrub being at the edge like that. Good chase right there. Oh, that was interesting. I think Carl went for a hard read with that pound right there. That dare will take it, though. And now Scrub is up. But he gets red rested again. Big Buffalo is on point with these rest reads tonight. Let's go. I hear because oh, there's another potential rest, but good on him. Just didn't want to go for it. That should be a rest right there. Here comes another rest. And he does not, and good DI, but it's not enough. Big Buffalo cleans up that game 2 0 in his favor. We're going to game three, and Scrub is on his tournament life right now. He's running it back to Yoshi's. Very interesting, because Big Buffalo showed that even though this is a good Falco stage, it's also a good Puff stage, because it's very hard to live those rests. I know I said earlier that it's basically a guaranteed KO, and it's kind of not, but it's, mu it's, it's much more likely to, to be a KO at zero. Oh, uh, he goes for the rest read right there. Here comes the forward smash. That's going to take a stock. No follow up right there, but good crowd chance cancel shine to break it up. Good dare right there. Nice back here to dare. And. Alright, Scrub's looking a lot better this time around. He's turning it up. Alright, almost clips him with the side B. That wouldn't have killed, though, even though it had the spike. Forward Smash will take that stock, and Big Buffalo finally gets on the board. The double shine, though, from Scrub, though, to avoid the grab. No follow up right there. Oh, he misses the up air. That would have killed. Oh, good tech right there. Oh, oh, I love that right there. Good stuff to scrub with the walk pass to, to uh, side smash. Unfortunately, he does lose a stock there, but he is up by one. And joining me right on the couch. Oh, oh. Um. <laughs> okay, up throw. Good crouch cancel rest right there, and, and uh, Big Buffalo evens it up. Now Scrub, it's not his, tor his tournament life right now, but that up air will take the stock, and he's on the board, 2-1. So now it's Big Buffalo's turn to counter pick. Knowing him, he's going to stay puff prop, most likely. And we're going... Let's, yep, we're going to Dreamland. This is still a decent Falgo stage with the platform layout. But it's in Puff's favor in terms of survivability and, air, and air places to move around. Alright. No punish right there. Uh-oh. He misses the rest. 
That is gonna be a punish, and he dies off the top. That was a little bit stuffy. Oh, eats it, uh, eats out the Saibi with the Nair. Very smart by um, Carl, and he evens it out. All right, does not get the rest right there. He was looking for it though. Good dare though, takes the stop. Right. Looks like Scrub is um uh, has been adapting to uh Big Buffalo's uh puff throughout this entire set. He's um he definitely has gotten used to how he's playing. Alright, here comes the pressure. Goes a little bit too high to follow up though. Ooh, I'm a little bit surprised that Force Smash didn't hit. Pop's not gonna die just yet, though. Next hit should do it. Good shine. Good back here. Well, good DI by Puff into the stage. Oh, Scrub putting on the pressure right now. Good for a good nair right there. The big Buffalo's on his last stock for this game. And Scrub is sin high, which a 101% on his second stock. Here, nice grab right there. And here comes the pressure. Good shielding in the pound. Forward smash. Gonna take it. Barely though. Oh, that dare. Oh, and I think that was a misinput by Buff Big Buffalo right there. But Scrub ties it up. We're going to game five. Okay. So let's see if Carl's going to stay puff. All right, we're going found on and Buffalo is staying puff for game number five. So let's see what he can do. So um, Scrub definitely is adapted. Playing a lot more aggressively right now, in addition to his um, Bane Punish game. But here comes a rest. Alright, good start for Big Buffalo right there. Here comes the Punish, though. Doesn't get too much off it, though. Alright, here comes the pressure. Good Dare. He does float a little bit too far for the follow-up, but that Dare will take it. And we have a dead-even game. Oh, man, guys, this is going to be a close one, I could tell. Oh, that's a dangerous platform uh, height right there because Puff can easily get a rest. I'm not sure if up tilt, excuse me, I'm not sure if up tilt can hit, but it, it, I think it might, I think it might at that height. Yeah, he's going for it. All right, yeah, definitely Scrub is playing a lot more aggressive now. All right, no grab right there though. Oh, another rest by Big Buffalo. Very clutch because Scrub was at pretty low percent, but that forward smash will take it. So we're still a dead even game. This is back and forth. All right. Oh, whoa, that was weird. He just teleport. He down throw teleported onto the platform. I've never seen that, but that rest is going to take it. Scrub down to his final stock right now. All right, let's see what he can do. This is what counterpick is working out. That might do it. Oh, but he can't connect with the rest. Forward smash. Gonna take it. This is last stock, ladies and gentlemen. Game number five in loser's quarters. Wait, is this supposed to be best of five? Okay, even though it's loser's quarters. All right, whatever. This is still a hype set. All right, Scrub putting on the pressure with these combos right now. Oh, but Big Buffalo's one rest away from winning. Oh, good Geb attacks, weighing the rest. Oh my god, he's off stage. Gets back on. Buffalo, he's off stage. All right. All right, back in neutral. Both players are playing very carefully. That forward smash is going to do it. Big Buffalo takes out Scrub 3-2 in a dramatic game five.
What a set, ladies and gentlemen. That was super close. That could have gone either way. Holy crap. That was a bit of a heart pounder. All right, I guess I'm up playing concussed. I will see you guys in a little bit.
Show me complete! Whoa. 
everybody. Salty toucan here. <laughs> a very, very salty toucan. I lost to both of these guys. Now I'm going to commentate over them. Why? Because I am a good sport. I may be, I may salt, I may range, but at the end of the day, I am a good sport. Hello. And, that, and that's the, all that matters. And we got baby bird right here. How you doing, baby bird? Good, you? Been better, baby yeah, bird. It happens. Been better. Are you still in? Yes. Nice. Oh. You're, you're in Grands, right? Yes. Nice. Good I, for you. Thank you. I just played Kuba Kev's Falco in Winners. So I was a little confused, but it's whatever. Yeah, he was going Falco today for some reason. I guess he wanted to take a break from the fox. I guess. Yeah. Because he told, he told me um, yesterday he, he, he was just off. Uh, not yesterday. He told me uh, last week he was pretty playing pretty off. All right. Oh, did this happen to him at Omega or something? I don't know. I keep forgetting that Omega happened. Like I did, <laughs> Today, like, because cause we, someone comes to me, he's like, oh, I went to Omega. I'm like, when did Omega happen? And he's like, yesterday. I'm like, shoot. Did you, I'm assuming you missed it? Yes, I missed it. <laughs> well, it wasn't as bad as last year where I signed up for it, and then I realized I was going to Vegas that week, oh, and I was okay. like, crap. I even emailed them. I was like, hey, give me back my venue, and they never get got back to me. I was like, thanks. Oh, you should have you should have kept going. should have kept pestering them about it. Why, why is he playing Pikachu? I have no clue. I did not know, even know he had a Pikachu. I guess he... No, oh, I know why. Because Kukus doesn't know how to play against Pikachu. Ah, <clears throat> I guess that might make sense. All right. And expect a few taunts to come out because these guys just talk a lot of shit about each other. <laughs> They're good friends. Oh, that oh shield's getting gosh. pretty low. I really hope he loses. I hope Big Buffalo loses because Pikachu is a horrible, not fun character. Really? Yes. <laughs> oh my god. And, and there's the counter taunt right there. Oh, the double taunt. It, oh, oh, come on. You should have rested him right there. Come on. He could have taunt canceled it, though. How? Uh, Pikachu's ends. Pikachu has like ISA frames or something because you can shield out of it before it's finished. Oh, that's stupid. Yeah, so it still makes all the noises and stuff, but like halfway through the taunt, you can shield out. Oh, that's that's really stupid. That's like a freaking bayonetta taunt. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that should be a stop. Or, oh, maybe not. Yeah, I have to agree with you. Even though I play as Pikachu's worst matchup, I just like. The, the last PH I played was, um, was either Electric electric flun, Flux or Bonk Cushy. Oh, okay, yeah. They're both really good um, Pikachus from Mass, I believe. Are they both Massachusetts? Uh, I thought Bonk Cushy was MDVA, but I could be completely wrong. I, I, I think electric, electric Flux I played in Boston. Yeah, he, he goes to BU, I think. Yeah, and we, we just played friendlies, but it, we went about even. Like, I just, and I just realized through that my time playing him in Bonk Cushy, Bon this stupid electric rat is really freaking hard to hit. Yeah, he is. It's yeah. just it's just annoying. I know. Oh my gosh. I thought he was just going to hold in take 100%. You yeah, know, the only Pikachus I've played were... Uh, I think I played Electric Flux, but on that play, so it doesn't really mean anything. And I played uh, someone named Tyler Swift from Long Island oh. once or twice a while ago. Uh, I never heard of that second one. Uh, I think he plays with Zane on stream a lot. I think that's his claim to fame currently. Okay. It's like Big Buffalo played with Chew. You know, yeah, that. yeah. All right. So um, that was game one, I believe. Yeah, that was game uh, one going to Big Buffalo, I think. Thank goodness he switched. And he switches to Fox. Oh, God. Yeah, I think that game was a little bit too close for him. All right, we're going to go to Dreamland for game number two. Good pit stage for Papa. We all know that by now. We're so, seeing a lot of more stalling by um, Concuss, more defensive play. Oh, that was very lucky. Yes, because uh, <laughs> he was at the point where he just didn't go over, so thank God for that. <sighs> All Big Buffalo has to basically do is just run away. Because even though, oh, wow. Oh, well, now we can run away because yeah. he has the stock move. He just shark the heck out of him. I don't know, like, the stage is good for Puff, but it's, Puff, also it's so hard for Puff to catch Fox. Yeah, because he's just super fast, especially on this stage where Fox is just much more mobility um, than uh, Puff. Like he just he just faster. Puff has the advantage in the air, but Fox's fall speed is really fast, and so there's not really pu much Puff can do about it. Mm -hmm. Then again, there's not really much that most characters can do about it. That should be a stop. Yeah, it should be dead. Yeah, that's a good trade. 
Oh my god. That could have could have rested that at a shield, but it's yeah. like kind of frame tight, so. It is, oh so I don't blame god. him for being a little bit safe. Good DI though, so he doesn't get off throw up here. That's a rest. That's a, yeah, that should be death. But here comes the punish. Hey, it's even. Dead oop, oop, good yep. rest. I think he might. Oh no! Good it was, DI. Like, it was just a little bit too high of yeah. a percent. Yeah, that was really good DI though. It shows that these two just play with each other a lot. Uh oh! Oh my god! Oh no! He missed the he, jump. Yeah, he, that should have been him. Now he's in trouble. That I was extremely he... unnecessary. And oh. I, if he didn't do the wall jump, like, like he could have got the edge guard much easier. Yeah. But it's whatever. Oh. All right, that's a wrap. Oh, no, he misses it. Hey, well, he missed. That's not going to be death, I think, but... Oh, oh no! <laughs> okay, well... Oh, shoot. It's a little bit of a clown fiesta. Yeah. They're throwing pies at each other. <laughs> I think that would be a good game. Just clowns throwing pies at each other. I'm sure it's done. Been some shovelware game. Yeah, I was gonna say some uh some Wii game probably. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't be surprised. Hey, right, one one wins on his best counter pick and only real counter pick of the matchup. Yeah, I'm assuming Buffalo would probably want to go FD or Yoshi's at this point. Mm -hmm. Um, oh, what's he doing? Lame. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, the trash talk. Oh, 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 we got a doc coming out. Okay, okay, so I know a lot about this matchup because my friend, he had to play doc and bracket one time and got really stressed out and learned as much as possible about it. And uh, it's pr it's pretty even. Because doc, doc has a, probably the rest, best rest punish in the game with cape because it doesn't knock him out, out of rest. That's right. So you just get like 60% into whatever kills you want. And it's like he's like a weird combo weight, so... Yeah, Mar yeah, Mario and Dr. Mario are really weird to combo. They can get get out of a lot of stuff. Yeah. Um, I really think Doc is underrated. I, I definitely think he's viable. Like, I, like... Well, that was a weird upbeat. I'm surprised that uh, sent him to the... It looked like it should have reversed, but it didn't. Uh, uh, big buff just kind of needs a grab. Because once he gets a grab, it should be lead to a kill. Hey, he's just going for F smash, though, which isn't why you want to play this character, I think. <laughs> yeah, that's. But anyway, um, Concuss is up a stock, although I'm pretty sure Doc is one forward air away from killing. Yes. Uh oh. I think he, he could have rested that, but he there just we went go. for the safer option. Yeah, and there's the fair, just mm -hmm. add a hit stun, let do a kill. Yeah. I'm not sure if a down throw forward, a forward air works on pop. I, I yes, it does. It. Oh, it does. Yes, it does. Interesting. Uh, that's why uh, the rest punish is so good because it's like for, at zero you can kill puff with a rest punish. Oh damn, that's that's really good to hear. Yeah. I used to play um, not Doc, but I used to play Mario as a kid. So maybe I'll pick him up for this matchup. Mario's a little bit different though. It's not nearly as good because uh, fair doesn't do anything and he has no kill options. Yeah. All right, so uh, this counter pick's not really working out hey, too well. Hey, that's death. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, he's dead. You can't. You can't Never jump mind. fair off stage in this game, or else you just die. Yeah. Yeah. Now that I think about it, now, I'll just stick with my sister. <laughs> I just, I just love. I, they're like the only character I can play uh, that I like to play. Yeah. So. I mean that makes sense. Yeah. That's how I feel about Falco. Everyone else is kind of lame to me. That's all right. We're solo mains. <laughs> We're awesome. All right, so um, game number four coming up. Let's see where uh, Buff wants to go. I think FD or Pokemon, but who knows? I I agree with those two. I was thinking those. Oh my god, I'm tired. But Yoshi's is also fine, but I don't know. Yeah, yeah. but he just lost there. But then again, he is going box, so. He did, yeah, he did lose with Doctor Mario. Don't know why he went Doc though, but. Um, he's probably very confident that he's gonna win, and went to the BM his friend. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> I, I don't take any chances with that. Trust me. Yeah, no, it's not. It's oh, not worth that, it. That almost uh, killed him. Hey, these up smashes at the ledge are a little questionable. Like just charging up smash at the ledge versus buff isn't gonna work. Yeah, that back air will wall you out for days. Also, again, that could have been a rest at a shield, but he full hopped out instead of short hop. I think it's like extremely worth learning. Because uh, so many foxes kind of just spam on smash and neutral at kill percents so that you can get cheesy kills. Yeah, the thing is, I mean, it is a pretty safe move, 
Good SDI, by the way, on that. Um, it is pretty safe because it has very, it has surprisingly low cooldown, but um, at the same time, the more you do it, the more you're going to get punished. It's you'll you'll teach someone how to punish it if you just keep spamming it. That is that is true. All right. Big Bubble's kind of just able to take center whenever he wants, which is not a good thing in this matchup. As Bubble, you need to hold it as dearly as possible. Yeah, because once you uh, lose space to Fox, you're in trouble. Like yeah. the less stalling space you have, the, the worse the character gets. Oh my gets. lord. That was some ext extreme, like, stretch hitboxes. Hey, we could get a four stock here. And... No, never mind. Okay. Still in a very advantaged position. Advantageous position, I should say. Hmm. I think he tried the shield drop, which as buff is not very good, because it, it's yeah, just not very good as buff. Yeah, I guess your quickest option Ash, out of that would be Nair, and that doesn't really cover that much. Yeah, and also when Puff uh, shield drops, her body actually becomes taller. Oh, it does? Yeah, it's weird. Oh, that is strange. Good F smash. He should get back. Good angle right there. I really like that. He'd cover it with down tilt, though, which might be the worst possible move you can choose. Because Puff's down tilt is atrocious. Yeah, like, we don't see it that often. I, I was so, seeing Concussed using it as an edge guard tool, mm -hmm. but even if it hits, it doesn't really send you at a bad angle. Yeah. I mean, so. if you're going to down smash, you might as well down smash, because it, it sends it in a very bad angle. Yeah, the, the down, Puff's down smash is really good. It's short range, but if it hits it, it sends it at a really bad angle. So. It's just a much better down tilt. Mm -hmm. Anyway, we got a game five situation going on right here, folks. Uh, let's see which one of these friends is going to BM the other on the way home, because I'm assuming they came here together. <laughs> this is for the gas money, ladies and gentlemen. All right, going to found in game number five. Um, this, I don't know, this could be good for either character. I mean, I'm a huge fan of it as a spacey player, but I know a lot don't like it. Yeah, like, I know Falcos in particular don't like this stage. Oh my god, the up air killing at 65. We got a uh, big buffalo with the first blood. Oh, he's putting on the pressure right now. Wow. The shine spike. Oh my god. Seems like big buffalo might like this stage. Yeah, I think so too. But here comes the rest. But he's going to get punished right now. It was still worth it though, I'd say. <laughs> okay. You probably should have went for more, something more damaging than that, but... I mean, it's it's like a very simple option. It's hard to mess up. Yeah, like... Oh, that's, oh that's another rest. And bad DI too, but this might be a rest punish. Gets it just <laughs> in time. He just didn't DI the smash at all, though. Yeah, I think if he DI'd it, he might have lived. Uh, possibly. I'm not entirely sure. I mean, Fallon does have a high ceiling, so there is a good chance. But DIing it is just better than not DIing. Yeah, even as a puff player, you should be able to DI it. Like, even at Hungrybox, he guys it when he's pissed that he missed a rest. Damn. Okay, so Concussed on his Torment life right now. Big Buffalo really turning it up to 11 right now. This is still... Oh, that's Oh, he that's going to... Yeah, that's, um, that's going to be a punish right there. But he misses the up air. It's still doable, though. Oh, he doesn't go for a jab. Well, rest is pretty much off the table because if, even if he rests, he could get killed. If Jabry said F smash, is still... Very, a very strong option. Yeah, okay, rest is definitely off the table right now at this percent. Okay, so uh, Concussed really has to play solid neutral in order to get through it. Good back air, reading the up B back on. I don't agree with that move at all, though, from Carl's part, but he still is in a good position. Uh, that might be death. That is death. Okay, game five, last stock. Let's see who's going to take this and who's going to just keep bad-mouthing the other person on the way home. <laughs> I mean, uh, Big Buffalo just has to watch out for rest. Oh, see, oh. that could have been a rest out of shield. It might not have killed, but... I don't think it would have killed, It would have uh, depended on DI. All right, let's see if Concuss can bring this back. Oh, my... Up the, oh, oh. This is huge. It's, Anyone's what? getting back here out of oh shield. <gasps> oh, my God. Oh, no DI at all. He, does, he gets it. That's it. <laughs> That's it. Concuss <laughs> takes it. Oh, my God. That's pretty funny. Damn, Concuss fighting back from the depths of hell for that one. He just eliminates Big Buffalo. Oh, my God. That was definitely an interesting end. Okay, so now I see why I lost Concuss. He is just 
clutching it out right now. All right, so now we got winner's finals. Pincus going up against Koopa Cab. Oh, th th this is loser's finals, I said. Yes. I, uh, I think you said winner's finals. But Did I? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Oops. Oh, well. Yeah, yeah loser's finals. I'm pretty sure they played in winners, and it was... I don't know the score. Oh, it's 3-1? Okay. Uh, what? Yeah, yeah. No, uh, they played in semis, right? Oh, what's their one? Uh, starting on Yoshi's? Oh, no. Wait. Yeah, we're, yeah, we're starting on Yoshi's. This is a, this is this is a real map. Yeah, yeah. They're going at it. Oh, I think the Koopa Kev's cam is messed up. Okay, I'll go fix it. Oh, you got it? Okay, Barry will get it. Uh-oh, now it just went offline. All right, sorry guys for the technical difficulties. Uh, I mean, concussed is uh, just causing so much hype that he gave the camera a concussion. <laughs> I don't understand why he started on the stage. This is easily the worst one to start on. Maybe he just wanted to get it out of the way. That that kind of is a strategy. Hell, if he wins on this, this would be a big blow. It is a strategy, but I don't, know, I don't really think it's too worth it. Yeah, I'm not for it. Like, for me, it's just about getting the next victory. Oh. <laughs> Shoot, okay, we're getting some really technical difficulties, guys. Please t please bear with us. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. All right, well, we got the the player cam up, but now the uh, the stream itself. Hey, we're back. Okay, yay. Okay, guys. Sorry about that. Anyway, oh, we got a little bit of lag. Okay. All right, thanks, Bear. All right, so Koopa Kev's up three socks to two. We hit the forward smash, gonna connect. Good up air. Good back air right there. Does it work? Oh, Alright. He went for the forward smash, but it was a little bit too greedy right there. A little bit greedy right there as well. Good back air to clip the side B, and that's gonna be a death. I mean, he's, he's doing surprisingly well for being Yoshi's. Uh, I don't know, it's it's weird. Yeah, again, I'm a little bit surprised. Cause this is a, this is arguably Falco's best stage. Either that or Pokemon. Yeah, I would I would agree. You get just very early kills on both stages. Alright. Oh, oh uh, the shy, shy guy, guy DI. Nice. Alright. This is still doable for Concuss, but he does have a bit of a mountain to climb. Oh, he went for the rest. I agree with that, but um unfortunately that he was would, a little bit off. He could have done a much Better res punish than up smash, but I don't know. Like shine, like double shine may have killed from that height. He could have done like dare shine, shine or dare up tilt shine to maybe try and kill. But yeah, at zero you can kill off the top. Yes. Right. And we had uh, Koopa Kev at the magical percent, and he wins at the magical percent, which means he automatically wins the set. Just kidding. It's a one zero. Uh, yay, one zero. All right. So uh, concussed. Um, I think he might go FD on this orb Dreamland. I keep forgetting that Dreamland is a thing. And right. you could have uh, tech chase rest. Yeah, think. he did. Th he was doing that in an earlier set. I, I guess he didn't want to uh, risk it because I mean, Koopa Kev is no slouch. Yeah. Even though he's not going Fox, he is no slouch. I mean, the fact that he's in losers finals with Falco says that he is has a pretty competent Falco. He might just be scared to go for the rest because last set he missed a couple and got punished for it. Yeah, that could be it. Plus, it's late in the bracket. He, he, he has a shot to win this whole thing. So, and then, I'll be honest, this is the farthest I've ever seen him get. Like normally, yeah. like he just doesn't make it past the second half of bracket. But, oh, so he's, um, do he's doing really well today, then. Yeah, he really is. I mean, he's gotten better. Like, I've noticed the past two times I play him, he usually takes the first game off of me, mm -hmm. and then I beat him. Yeah. And he did so again when I played him, but, like, he just... He, he picked... Uh, I mean, he did really good the games that he won. Yeah. And that last game... That last game, I honestly think I should have won, but he just got lucky with the rest. I mean, that happens. It does. It just sucks because it was last last game, last stock. Uh. That's what I, that that's life versus puff. Uh, it's also life for life versus ice too. Yes, it is. Oh, that was a that rest. was a rest, and he did not what go the for heck? it. Yeah, I think the pressure's getting him a little bit. I mean, he is ahead right now, but 
All right. I that, love that. That was, that good. Tom yeah, that was a good tomahawk. He could have rested him right there, though. And I think he would have gone away from it on skate because Puff has huge survivability on the stage. That's a good and now, and now Puff's at the magical percentage. There we go. Takes the stock. Yeah, Kukip's gonna have to work really hard to kill uh kill Concuss right now. Cause he he'll just live forever unless he dies off the bottom. But Puff doesn't die off the bottom. Well at this percent she probably will. Maybe. That back air will not take it, but next one probably will. Good up air, and I, it takes it. Wow. A I'm bit surprised. I'm shocked that killed. Yeah, he probably could have DI'd that better. He could have DI'd a little bit better, but still. It's normally not going to kill. I thought it wouldn't have killed. Like, come, come even close. Oh, no. Down throw against buff kind of should never work. Because you can, uh, it shouldn't... It, it, you don't always get knocked down. Like, you can choose when you get knocked down by it. So, I don't know. That down throw tech chase is, isn't very you, real. Wait, how can you choose when you get knocked down by uh, it? Uh, Puff, if you hold... I'm, I could be wrong, but I know there's... If you hold a certain way, I'm pretty sure it's a way. Uh, you don't get knocked down. You kind of, like, bounce off the ground and float away. Huh. So, it's kind of like a fox-ish thing where you don't actually get knocked down by down throw. Interesting. Yeah. Oh no, we got a daddy laser coming out. And he does have a double cover ledge, yeah, nice. Good, good. Smart from uh, Concussed going for the ledge right there. Yeah, he hasn't really been covering ledge all too much. Or, like, at least not hard committing the ledge, so. So he has kind of been getting off away from free. That was just a hard read, kind of. Yeah, yeah. He just read his recovery. Okay, last stock. Let's see if Concuss can bring this back. All right, there we go. It's probably feeding for a shield grab. Yeah. All right, not looking good for Concussed right now. Oh, he's near the ledge. I don't think he has jumps left. <laughs> uh, now he, I don't think he does now. Oh, good yeah, dare, because yeah. I think he was gonna go for a dare right there. That back there will do it though. All right. Yeah, dr drill kind of beats uh, any of Falco's like, options when he comes from below you, so. That's good. Yeah, he needed that, otherwise he was probably gonna get dared off stage. <laughs> Ooh! Oh! <laughs> Damn it, concussed! Oh. I would have dropped some serious knowledge if he did that. Okay, going back to Dreamland, game number three. Yeah, he kind of just has to. He got Koopa Kip off stage a lot, but he just needs to edge guard him a little bit better. Yeah, and he missed a cup, quite a few rest opportunities mm -hmm. too. Yeah, yeah you, you can't do that as Puff. You really, I know rest is a highly committal and can be. You might second guess yourself. <clears throat> that is obviously a factor, but um, you got to go for it, especially this late in the tournament and against someone as good as Koopa Kev, You got to do it. You got to prove yourself. Because I think, I think Koopa Kev is PR in New York. Uh, like the, like the NY, or the Tri-State one, I think? I, I know he's, I think, I'm pretty sure he's top 20 if, if there's a PR, because in New York you gotta be top 20. Yeah. I don't, I forgot who's on that PR, but I remember. I know, I, I'm pretty sure Smokey is. Yeah. And I think JD is, although I haven't seen JD play in a while. Yeah, he's been, he's been a little MIA. Yeah, it kind of sucks, because I remember when I first met him, he was, he's a really chill oh, really? dude. Oh. Wait, what happened? Uh, he, he might have moved somewhere. Oh, that, okay, so he might be settling back in or something like that. But shout out to JD. Please come back. <laughs> I still need to play you more. Nah, I'm okay with no one coming except for me so I can win. <laughs> hey. I'm trying to win as much. Hey, eventually you're going to have to face me, though. So. That is true. Yeah, we would I, We would have probably had to... Oh, wait, I probably would have to face Koopa Cat if I... Uh, no, I would have had to face Big Buffalo if I beat Concuss. Yeah. So then I would probably have to play you in Grands. If, God forbid, I made it all <laughs> Still gotta beat Big Buffalo. I still... The only win I have on Big Buffalo is that money match the day we met. Mm. I didn't even know who the hell he was. And then he's like, oh, two trained him. I'm like, okay. He plays the matchup actually very well. Yeah, he does. He's definitely... Oh, really? That's definitely probably his best character matchup. But unfortunately, he says that he's just not as good against everyone else. Yeah. Although he did pretty good tonight. Yeah, he did. He kind of lost the concuss because he was joking around a bit, I think. But yeah. 
Man, what a bunch of jokers. <laughs> I have to say that because I am a Shulk me Well, uh, well, I do play Shulk in Ultimate, so got to say that. Um, anyway, Kakus is on his winner's life. For, um, not his winner's life. His tournament stock right now. Uh, that should be the stock right there, but he's got a huge amount on the climb. Got two stocks to go in order to stay alive. And he's sitting at 61% right now. It's not looking good. Um, but at the very least, he will get third if he loses. So he will get payout. Yeah, he so, might get his money back. Who oh, knows? who knows? Maybe he'll make a dollar profit or something. <laughs> That is the thing. Ooh, up smash on a shield. Very interesting option right there. Yeah, it's actually pretty good because it'll, it'll knock you down, and most of the time it's like a tech trap. So, uh, oh my god. That's going to do it. Hey, well. have three have three O's concussed. Very good stuff to concuss, though. Making it all the way to loser's finals, getting third place. I got to give him a hand. Good shit to you, man. Okay, now... It's the moment we all have been waiting for. We got Grand Finals, Koopa Kev versus Baby Bird. This has been an interesting night, ladies and gentlemen. It's full of upsets. I know I got double upset tonight, which... It happens. It just happens. Okay. So we got Koopa Kev coming in from the loser's side. He's master. He's got the blue tag. A master blue regard. Shout out to Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends. Pretty good show. Or he's blue da ba dee boo da, -da. And Baby Bird going with his trademark um, appendi male appendage tag. Yep, he's going with the dick, I guess. Okay. So let's see where we're going to go first. I think this will be an upset if Baby Bird can take this. Did Baby Bird win in a, against Koopa Kevin Winners? Did, okay, yeah, so Baby Bird did beat Koopa Kevin winners. Not, I don't think I commentary that one. Anyway, Grand Finals, we got the Falco Ditto going to Dreamland right now. Not Dreamland, uh, Fountain Dreams. So we got uh, Koopa Kev rocking the blue tag. We got Baby Bird rocking the green Falco. Or Falcos, excuse me. Oh, no jump. That's a stock. Okay, first stock going to Koopa Kev. Good power shield right there. He's turning it up. But good grab right there. Oh, good dare and a little bit of a flub from Takupa Kev with the SD. Got an even game though. Alright. Alright, so if Koopa Kev can take this whole tournament with Falco, I think that would be a good um, redemption from last tournament. His last tournament, he didn't... I don't think he was playing his best. I mean, he did good against me, aside from the SD, the last game. But he's proven himself right now. He's up a stock. He's putting the pressure on. Alright, and we got Big Buffalo joining me on the setup. Alright, Buffalo, tell me. Are you going to be hearing it on the way home from Kukust? Up, oh, he's not joining me yet. I uh, tangled up. All right, that was a bit of a hard read going right there. All right, Big Buffalo, how are you doing? Oh. Uh, never mind, he's having a little bit of trouble. Okay. Yeah, I'm back. How you doing, Big Buff? I'm not driving Tim home. That's how I'm doing. Yeah. <laughs> he, he's getting an Uber. We're leaving right after this. <laughs> I I warned him so. Oh. No, I'm not gonna give him that treatment. It's okay. Yeah, I would, yeah, yeah. I would love to, but you know. <laughs> I wish I could do that to some people, but I drive alone with nobody else. That's good. You don't have to take people home. Yeah. I got four people with me I got to take home. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, I know. Whatever. Okay. And, and we're all, we were all top four. Top three, too. Top four, actually. Whatever. Yeah, I uh, I wasn't. I don't think. I, 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 I see why you got mad for losing to Tim. I, I, I was a little the, angry, too. Yeah. That's why I walked away a little bit. You did? Yeah. I took a little break. Oh my god, I don't want to talk about that. Oh, we got an SD uh. from Baby Bird. Yeah, let's see how I did. I don't think I made top five. You did, you got fifth. Oh, I got fifth? Yeah. Oh. I got fourth. Am I? 20 points, oh boy. Oh, yay. <laughs> I, I don't know how many, how many points did I get there? 55, oh, 
Oh, so, oh what, nice. What are these points for anyway? Uh, for defending north. Yeah, guys. So uh, just quick heads up. We are running a uh, small um, uh, tournament to get free venue and a hotel room at uh, Defend the North, which is coming up this July. Unfortunately, I don't think I'm going to be able to make it. Even though I have the, the Saturday off, I am going up to Rhode Island with my friends to hang out with them. So that will be out for me, but I'm going to see how well I can do. And if you guys want um, to try your hand at it, it's not too late. Come on out. Even if you can't make it at this point, um, spectate. <laughs> yeah, just come out and prove what your your um, prove your metal. Oh. Oh, interesting. So yeah, you can win it if you win Super Smash Out, which is when. June 29th. Twenty June 29th. I. Oh, I can't make that either. I'm gonna be in the Bahamas right for that. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. I, it's a shame. My best friend's coming down from California. I want to drag his butt to one of these tournaments. Not for Melee, but for Ultimate. And yeah. he's like, oh, I gotta see my friend. And I'm like, oh, boy. This is gonna be tight then. Yeah. But we'll see where it is, how it goes. Um, anyway, enough about me. Um, ba Baby Bird has got Koopa Kev on his last stock right now. At 91%. He is on stage. Oh. Okay. Very nice to get back on stage. Uh, I'm pretty sure that jab was a bit of a mistake. I think he wanted up tilt. Yeah. That should be a stock. Yeah, he he they were very good. I just I just couldn't like I couldn't even get a game. Yeah, yeah. he's been proving that he's been in the lab right now. Yeah. I mean I haven't played Baby Bird in a while, but the past two tournaments he's turned up. I think I, he's like, he's got made brands the last two tournaments now. Yeah. I mean I I feel like I maybe I would get one if I wasn't like this was my first tournament in months. Yeah. yeah. You did pretty good, though. Yeah, I, I uh, losing the Tim's not good, but you know it's okay. Yeah. I think this might be my water, actually. Oh no. <laughs> not mine. Berry, but I don't think it is. <laughs> oh god, <laughs> the mystery water. I know I'm a huge germaphobe. Uh, Shoot. What do you want to sit down? Oh. There's Tim the Dream Breaker over here. The Dream Breaker. Yeah, yeah we got Concussion joining us on the couch right now. Who's not getting a ride home. <laughs> yeah, I told him that. Okay. Um, so, Kev is up one. But Concussed, just, I mean, not Concussed. Uh, Baby Bird just yeah. evens it right out. Um, yeah, we're just having a good time right now. I mean, we're, we're hoping for a 3 1, aren't we? Um, okay. <laughs> well, there's, I don't know. We'll see. I, I honestly don't care who wins. I would love to see Baby Bird take it, yeah. but at the same time, Koopa Kev's going Falco, who I never knew he had. Yeah, we, we, me and Tim both want to go home. <laughs> um, I, I'll, it, be, I'll be honest, I kind of want to go home too. <laughs> this, um, this, this, is, this is the problem with driving good players to tournaments. Yeah, let me see what time it is now. It's almost 11. Oh, shoot. Well, this will be almost over. Uh, it's their fault. They started a tournament at like 8 o'clock. <laughs> Well, well they, we're starting at 7.30 now. Oh, actually, no, because Scrub, I think, screwed up the bracket. It's all right. Uh, Tim, yeah. Tim liked it since he played him. Yeah, two, two can, yeah, two can. Well, you kept camping me. <laughs> you're Puff, you're, you're supposed to camp. Uh, I was complaining the whole time. Like, if this goes to game five, we're never gonna get home, and I was right. <laughs> I wouldn't have cared if I didn't get rested on my last stock. You know what? Tim didn't didn't rest me. He edge guarded me. That's the uh, same shit, man. same stuff. I know, but that's that's the thing. No. We yeah, yeah. If we if we get a bracket reset, we're we gonna be there's get, gonna be no commentary, guys. I'm sorry. We got a reset. We're gonna leave, we're gonna leave Kevin. <laughs> or Barry could do it. <laughs> he doesn't play melee, but he. Ugh. Okay, last stock, game number three. Let's see who's gonna take it. That's not true. Shield is getting pretty low. You need you need decent wins. Uh... Oh, it just makes yeah. it back. Oh, good, getting back on. That might have been the medium shorten. I don't know. Yeah. It does. I think that is a one frame window. Oh, that should be it. Oh no, no. no. not good GI. Oh. <gasps> 
A spike. Oh, that was clutch uh, coming from Baby Bird. Koopa Kevin unfortunately got clipped by that. He knows that we need to go home. Yes, Baby Bird's doing this for the people. Yeah, we gotta go home. He's letting us <laughs> spread our wings now so we can just fly on home. Yeah. I got laundry to do, no joke. Yeah, I gotta get up early for work. I do too, unfortunately. He sucks. Ryan, don't over, don't see him above me. He got a lucky, lucky break. I'm consistent. I'm consistent. That, 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 that's that's. But I, I haven't been here in a while. You know I'm good. Yeah. If I if, I, if we didn't have to go home, I would play pop. So I would. <laughs> I wasn't, I, I wasn't trying to do a pump today, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that would have been horrible to uh, watch. No, I think my, I think my pot, if I just didn't, like, go peeking and dog, I think I would have won. I don't know. Yeah, you should not have gone dog. I don't know why the hell you You know what? Dog. I used to beat him with dog back when we played back when we played last year and stuff. So I thought maybe it would be a surprise pick. Eh. I don't know. I don't know. So that's what happened. That's whatever. He lost. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know what? It, it's good for him. I, I wouldn't want to admit it, but he hasn't beat me in like a year yeah, or something. This is probably the farthest Concuss has ever gotten. Yeah. Not the third place. Uh, he's got my respect for doing that, even though I think that was a bullshit way of winning games at five. But same thing with me. I feel, we both feel the same thing. Because I had, you know what, I got, I got very nervous. It's like your typical H Fox versus a Fox last uh, go. Yeah. Go. My, I was like charging up Smash. I got so like shaky. Yeah, I was really nervous. I will admit, I, I was nervous he was going to get in. He got in. And, uh, as soon as he, yeah. I got hit by that one up tilt, I'm like, fuck yeah. no! Yeah, you know, you know, I learned you can't be nervous for the rest or the wobble. I'm not nervous for the wobble, but I'm nervous for the rest. I got to like change that up. Yeah, because the, re the wobble you can't punish. But you can punish rest sometimes. I don't know. I get more nervous for rest, even though like wobble is like more deadly. It's weird. Just the way I am. Anyway. Yeah, I guess. Anyway, we got a dead even game four. Um, yeah, we really haven't been paying him too much attention. Sorry, guys. This is a Falco dead. Yeah. Herb <laughs> yeah. ditto. Nice. Okay, Koopa Kev on his tournament stock. Baby Bird championship point. Let's see if he yeah. can take this. All right, we got the shine combos going on right now. Yeah. All right, he's turning it up right he, he, now. He told me he hasn't won a tournament here yet, so this is exciting. This is going to be big if he can beat Koopa Kev. Even though he's not going his main, yeah. down smash. That's going to take it. Baby yeah. Bird takes, smashed out 86. 86, man. 3-1. <laughs> uh, good, good shit to both players. Very good. And good shit for Koopa Kev for getting in this far with um, Falco. Falco. He, he whooped us with Falco. Well, actually, he didn't beat me. He beat Tim twice. And, uh, All right, so... Yeah. We have uh, Defend the North stats coming out right now. So um, this is how it looks right now. Koopa yeah. Kev in the lead with uh, with 95 points. Wow. Baby, did it, was it up just updated? Yeah, it just updated. Okay, yeah. so we got Koopa Kev in the lead with 95 points. So far he's in the running to get that free venue and a free um, hotel yeah. at Defend the North at the New Yorker, which I think is a pretty nice hotel. Baby Bird is moves in the second. I'm, um, I'm 12. <laughs> You're 12. Oh, God. Scrubs in third. I, myself, Toucan, sitting comfortably at number four. Vortex. And Red Jax. Uh, Vor Vortex just got 50 points out of that one win from last oh, look! Oh, Tim Tim got a good amount. Oh, uh, yeah. Tim's now in the top ten. Good for uh. him. So, yeah, we got... Don't, don't, don't you only get some if you're first? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Vortex got 50 points for that one. He just came last week. He was like, all right, watch this, everyone. I'm going to get 50 points, and he just got 50 points. Anyway, good shit to Baby Bird. This is his first stuff. tournament win here. I can't. We. I can't win a tournament here. It's too, too stag. I've won. Right. I, I've won it one time. Oh. All right, we're headed off. All right. Okay, guys. So this is Toucan and Big Bubble. We Bumble gotta go home. Signing off. Peace, guys. Peace. This is what it's all about. This is why we throw these tournaments. You can prove yourself 
active in the northern. War is fury, there's no mercy. When the best dress is a black music. Woo! And, uh, That's uh, a lot uh, of him. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh! Please be like a two hit combo. Okay, Chubu NYC holding that pressure down. 